Greetings and welcome to today's lesson. In today's lesson we are going to uh, practice our phonograms and then we are going to look at some of the different errs. Alright, so first I'm going to have you turn to page 15 in the front of your book. Alright, so we've labeled these pages already, hopefully. Um, now you'll see that I have a sticky note here. Right? I'm going to do this and move this sticky note back each week. That makes it a lot easier for me to find these pages in the front because we're going to use these pages a lot. Right? So what we're going to do now is we're going to practice our phonographs. So now I've introduced all the phonographs to you and what we want to work on now is really mastering those phonographs. Right? So the first thing we're going to do is what we're going to do is practice what's called the oral phonogram review. Right? And this is where I'm going to show it to you and you are going to, to say it. All right. Now, because we're not one-on-one -on -one here, I can't see you and hear you, uh, I will say the sound afterward. All right. So you want to say it and then see if you can say it the right way. The first time we go through, we're going to do sounds. The second time, you'll want to say it and say the cue. And then, if there's any rule, I'll try to ask you what that rule might be for that one. All right. So here we go. And I've shuffled these all up, so they're all mixed up now. Okay. So here's the first one. So go ahead and say that. Right? A, A, A. G, J. B. J. Mm. A, U, U. Y, I, I. Ch, k, sh. Er. Er. E, e, a. U U O U F F A L N E A E Sh. All right. Now this time we go through. We want you. You're going to want to go through. You're going to want to say the sound, and then say the cue that would go along with it. Okay. A A A G J B J N A U U Y I I Ch, k, sh. This one has a Q. Er, her. This one has a Q. Er, nurse. E, e, a. That's a Q and a rule. K. Two letters may only be used after a single vowel that says its first sound. This one has a Q. U, U, not used. O, U, of, of, ah, ow. This one has a Q. Mm, two letters beginning. They okay, only use the beginning of a word, beginning of a base word. E A I. All right, now there are going to be some rules for this. We haven't learned those yet, so I'm not going to go over those now. But there's this only certain times where we'll use this phonogram. Okay, last one. Sh. Short. All right. 
Now, what we're going to do is on page 15, so we have two more days of, of learning. Um, um, on Fridays will normally be your test day, so we won't do phonograms on Friday. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this page right here and we're going to fold it in half. Now normally we would use the left side, but since we only have two days, we're going to do it like this. All right. So what you're going to do now is you're going to go straight down this red line. Right? You're not going to use this side until tomorrow. You're going to go straight down this left side. All right? Keep it nice and neat. So I am now going to shuffle up the phonogram cards so they won't be in the same order. And I'm going to say the phonogram, the sounds, and the cue if there is one. And then you will do your best to write it. Now don't look at the screen and um, and until you're done writing it because you want to see if you got it right. If you didn't get it right, what you'll do is you'll just cross it out and write the correct phonogram. That will be the phonograms that you need to spend extra time studying during your independent time. All right, so here's the first one. The first one is Now as you write it, say it. Next one. O, oh, U, F, off, ah, ow. He's saying, did you write it? O, U, F, off, ah, ow. Right, now look to see if you got it right. The next one. E, A, I. E, A, I. E, A, I. The next one, er, nurse. Say, did you write it? Er, nurse. Next one, u, u, not used. Say, did you write it? U, u, not used. Next one, e, e, a. Say, did you write it? E, E, A. Next one. Er, nurse. Oops, I'm sorry. Mark that out, erase that. If you wrote that already, I apologize. Er, her. Er, her. Next one. <laughs> Two letters. <laughs> Two letters. Say, did you write it? <laughs> Two letters. Next one. Ch -k -sh. Say, did you write it? Ch -k -sh. Next one. J. Say, did you write it? J. Next one. N. Mm. Say, did you write it? Mm. Next one. B. Say, did you write it? B. Next one. Mm. Two letters beginning. Mm. Two letters beginning. Go ahead and write it and say it at the same time. Mm. Two letters beginning. Next one, g j, g j. I didn't say it. G j. Next one, y i i. Say it. Write it. Y i i. Next one, a u u. A u u. I didn't say it. A u u. Next one, sh short. Say it, write it. Sh short. Next one, a a a. Say it, write it. A a a. Next one, e i. No, sorry, e a i. 
E A I. So you can write it. E A I. All right. That is all of the phonograph practice for today. All right, and now we're going to turn to page two in our in the front of our notebook. So we turn to page two. So you should have a two in the upper right hand corner. All right, and what we're going to do here is we're going to practice our ers. And now the thing that's interesting is what we find here is it makes a sentence. Okay, so we're going to do this as best we can. We're not going to fold our paper because uh, on this side, because we're going to have three columns, all right? So all the way to the left, we're going to put the er of her. We're going to write this as a sentence. Let's make capital H. Er. All right? Now, right in the middle, we're going to write the word first. Okay? Er. S. T. First. Okay? And now we're going to write the word nurse. N, er, s, e. All right. Over here, all the way to the left, we're going to write the word works. Works. W, er, x, s. Got to join those together. And then the last one is early. Er, o, yeah. And we're going to put a period there. It makes a word. All right? Now, we're going to do our markings. So, er, once. Underline the ER. First, er, once. A nurse has some extra markings. N, er, once. S, e, twice. And what is this e doing? It's not doing anything. So, we're going to put a job five. Works, what? Er, k, s, and then early. Oops, early. It's supposed to be two syllables. So let's separate that. Erase that. Separate that. L, y. Sorry about that. Er, once, ul, i. Rule six: English words don't say i. I don't. Uh, English words can't use i at the end of the word, but we don't put it here. All right. So here we're focusing on the er sounds. So the first word we're going to do is the word serve. Okay, so put our hands up. We're going to do words serve. So we're going to use our fingers to do our sounds. Okay, so s, er, v, e, serve. Right? So one syllable, serve. Now it's about e, r is together. Okay, go ahead and write serve. S, er, v, e. All right, now let's do our markings. S, er, once, v, once, e, twice, job, two. English words cannot end in a v, so we use an e on the end. The next one is the word herd, like a herd of goats, okay? Herd, base word, herd. Er, duh. If I have my hand up, you have your hands up. Okay, do exactly what I do, okay? And we're using the er of herd. Right? Go ahead and write it. Okay? Say it as you write it. Er, da. Right? Markings. Er, once, da. Next, we have the word dinner. Two syllables. Dinner. Den, ner. Sounds. Da, i, n, n, er. Dinner. We're using the er of her. Okay, you want to write it? Dinner, da, i, n, n, er. Okay, markings, da, i, n. Now, normally we have what's called rule 29 here, uh, but we're not going to mark that here, and we'll go over that later, okay? N, er, once. Dinner. Next, we have the word perfect. 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 Okay? Er, er of her. E -k -t. Perfect. You can write it. Per fact. Okay, markings. P er once. E -k -t. Perfect. 
And the last one we'll do for er is the word nerve. Okay? Like I have a nerve in my body. Nerve. N er v e. Nerve. Okay? Er of er. Can I write it? N er v e. Nerve. Markings. N er once. V cannot be used within the word, so I have to use an e. So underline once, underline twice, job two. All right, next we're going to do the word, uh, the words for er of first. Okay, the first one is sir, like hello sir. Here we go, sir, s, er. We're going to use an s. Okay, go ahead and write it. Say it as you write it, s, er. All right, let's do our markings. S, er, once. Okay. Next, we're going to do the word bird. Okay. Bird. B, oops. Bird. B, er, da. All right. So bird up first. Go ahead and write it. B, er, da. We're doing our markings. B, er, once. Da. Bird. Next, we have the number. The number um, or the word for a number is just third, like I came in third place, okay? Third, base word third, th er, da. Now, these two letters should be together, okay? All right, go ahead and write it, say just write it. Th er, da. Markings, th once, er, once, da. Okay, so all two letter phonograms get underlined. Next we have girl, g, er, u, girl. Okay, there you go. Girl, g, er, u. Markings, g, er, once, u, girl. And the next one is, let's do birth, birth, base word birth, b. Er, th, birth. Write it. B, er, th, birth. Markings. B, er, once, th, once. Birth. All right. Now we're going to do nurse today, and that will be where we stop for today. All right. The next word is the word turn. Okay. To turn around. Turn. Er, n, turn. Write it. T, er, n, turn. Markings. T, er, once, n, turn. Next, we have the word hurt, like I hurt my arm. Hurt, base word hurt. H, er, t, hurt. Okay, go ahead and write it. H, er, Hurt. Markings. H, er, once. T. Next, we have the word burn, like to burn something with fire. Burn. Base word burn. B, er, n, burn. Okay, I write it. B, er, n, burn. Markings. B, er, once, n, burn. Next, we have church. I'm going to go to church. Church. Base word church. Ch. Er. Ch. I'm going to use my other hand because I need some extra letters. And that CH should be together. Okay? I go and write it. Church. Ch. Er. Ch. Markings. Ch. Once. Er. Once. Ch. Once. The next one is fur, like an animal has fur. Fur, base word fur. Fur, fur. You should, when we do this, you should make all the sounds, say all the words, show all the fingers, everything just like I do, okay? Right, fur, say it as you say it, write it. Fur, fur, markings, fur, once, fur. All right, that's the end of our lesson for today. I hope you have a great day, and I look forward to seeing you next time.